Hakuna Matata snacks. You stay in the fuck out of my bins. Hey, oh, uh, what the hell, Odds? Did you shave in my hot tub? Bro, just chill. Just my pets. Have you even slept? Have you? I've been busy. Yeah. You cute? The Metal Schlong 1200 is not cute. It's a sexy, futuristic German welding machine. Whoa. Low impurities, minimal schlag, transition between auto and welder operated. What do your guys think about that? Well, they should be pumped. This town needs to get with the times. Yeah, makes sense. You break your back at work every day and I sling jeans for a living. Okay, Bubs, this is what I'm thinking, okay? You drive into the park, right as you come into the entrance, there's a workout station right here. You all don't call it a park, it's a community. Okay, community. But there's a workout station right there, all outdoor equipment. You can work out all year if you want. Well, maybe push it back, because I think when you come in, you need like a nice, like a nice gardeny kind of field that feels like you're driving into Beverly Hills. Because this is going to be a, this is no trailer park. With big this, like pillars and stuff and like a brick Not thing. pillars, but just like, you know, maybe, With maybe thing some in, palm trees. That, okay, nice. maybe that'd have to be fake though, bubs. Palm trees aren't going to survive. Well, you could put in fake palm trees and that'll lead directly down to where my kitty area is. How are you guys even awake right now, man? What are you doing up, man? <clears throat> you just went to bed an hour ago. What are you guys doing? We're not doing What's anything. That? It's nothing. It's my house. What is that? We're working on a contest, Ricky. Okay, what kind of a contest? It's open to the public. $25,000 prize for designing a modular home community. $25,000. 25K Why to the designing. The winning he's design. In, oh, he's, he's in now. What do nice I got to do? Nice going, Bubs. Well, you don't need to be in, Ricky. I'm designing it. I'm going to win the money, and then I will decide if you get any of it. Did you put a Did you put a gun range in? There's no gun range that's going in You've got to have a community grow up. A community. Ricky. No, Ricky. It's not like that. That's no. What the this is a is. nice community with, like, families and stuff. It's not like crazy drunken supervisors running around drunk, man, pissing themselves. This is not like Sunnyvale Trailer Park. This is a respectable community. That's right. You gotta have a job designed to by live me. here, which is a good idea. So check it out. So I think the Kitty Land Love Center area should take up 30 or 40 percent of the back. 30 or no, 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 no. You're talking. That's a waste of space, man. There's a lot of people that want a kitty area they can run with their cats. What about a ball field? Boys, we're talking like 10, 11 field. acres here. That's a lot of fucking real estate. Well, you design yours, I'll design mine. All right, mine. there's going to be a community. Well, there's going to design mine. How do I find out more details? You go to the website. What's the website? You know what? I'll just find a suit dummy to tell me. There must be a suit dummy who works for this company. There is. There is a suit. There is, okay? He's going to explain more of it, all right? Just go to the website. It's V-I-D-A something. Check Vida. it out. Vida. That's the name of the company. is not they? They make a cheese, too, don't they? That's Velveeta. This Holy one. fuck, our chips are good, boys, when you're stoned. I, I'm, I know, You know man. what? Get them the fuck away you from gotta me. Get it. You gotta get these away from me. I want to eat these later. That might be the best ketchup chip I've ever had. It's pretty fucking good. It's good I, like these, I like these wavy planes. It's got just the right amount of ketchup dust on it. I'm throwing these wavy planes, motherfuckers. All the wavy planes are unbelievable. This year featuring the Swayze Express. Swayze Express? Patrick Swayze? Julian's always been really sensitive about the whole Patrick Swayze thing because when we were kids in school, the other kids used to tease him and call him Patrick Swayze, but Julian was really into dirty dancing. I remember one time me and Ricky were coming over to get Julian to go ride bikes and we walked in the trailer and Julian was dressed up like him, pretending he was in the movie Dirty Dance. Ricky told everyone at school from then on, they teased him, Patrick Swayze. Ricky, did you shit yourself? <laughs> I don't think. I think you might have. <laughs> I don't think so, man. Oh, fuck. <laughs> All right, is it almost time to go? No, 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 no. Are you kidding me? Why does it have to happen right now? Jesus Christ, boys. Look how happy he is. You telling me he didn't shit himself? <laughs> Was that me. much uh, joy in his lungs? Wasn't me. I did no shower this morning. I just feel 
dirty right now. And now you got his okay, shit molecule sticking to your fur. Confused. Fuck. Uh, fuck. I need to, you know what? I'm getting drunk today. That's it. Why are you confused? <laughs> Just confused, man, about fucking Willy Wonka and the other little Wonka fuckhead. I didn't know there were Charlie, whatever the fuck his name is. I don't know, uh, man. I'm lost. Fuck. She was, she Did was, I say R? No, I just. <laughs> you don't allowed to say R. You don't have a ring. I didn't say it. I said it with an A. Arg. Wow. Uh, what the fuck do you mean the Spartans used to tongue each other's holes? That's what they used to do before battle buffs. The, the Spartans. Yeah, it's a big story, apparently. Like, they would lick each other's nipples what? and their, their, their rectums, and it, they would lick them before battle just to, to get extra testosterone. And you can also sunshine your butthole. If you sunshine that, like lift up your scrotum, and, and well, you're getting it on your butthole and your scrotum, it gives you more testosterone. What the fuck? What, you... Okay. Julian, that's why I thought you were right. getting such big pipes. I thought you... They also rub the tips of their penises together. And like, no, I guess they, they don't. They did right they before will... battle. Who said? Bob, Bob, you got to... Like, I don't know who it is, but it, it, it's uh, it's proven. Well, Henry, 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 Henry told me. Who the fuck's Henry? The history teacher, Henry. Who the fuck is Henry the history teacher? He's my trainer. I've been working out with him. Can you look at my triceps? Look. You haven't been bigger. training. Who in this park, or even who in the whole world, doesn't have problems? Who doesn't have a drink too many times once in a while, and maybe even winds up passed out in their own driveway, pissing themselves? Huh? I mean, serious. Well, who doesn't have a a little puff from time to time. Or who doesn't have problems with the people they love? Randy, everybody. And I apologize for my neglect of the things that are most important to me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, because this park it's the most important thing in my life, and it always will be, and so are all of you. Because this is our home. This is our community. I am Jim Leahy, and I am your trailer park supervisor. Thanks for coming, Randy. Is it God Sings Electric Avenue? No, that's Eddie Grant. Close enough. We gonna rock. Down to what does the Terrence Trent Darby, Darby sing again? What, what's his tune? Terrence Trent Darby. Oh, is that the one that sign your name across my heart or something like that? What? <laughs> what fucking song is that? <laughs> what? Sign my name across your heart? My heart? Is that right? I don't know where that came from. Dad, calm down. Oh, I'm fucking calm. <laughs> Dad, Mo really likes him. I want his great-grandfather to be a part of his life. You're just gonna have to get over it. He's your father, like it or not. Not! Julian is ripping his shirt off with his muscles and he's doing a super flex. Super flex. There, now they've got uh, enough material to do a, yeah, a remix. Don't do that. Please send in your remixes. It's exciting stuff. Pair of Swearnet to the Julian Superflex contest. We'll we'll judge them, and the winner gets a, a signed care package of merchandise. It's quite a fucking offer you're throwing out there. I just made it an official contest. The Julian Superflex 2024 Mega Contest. Sounds like a lot of work. I think you're gonna do all of it. No, man, don't do anything. I'll do it myself. Uh, you know what, you're just... You don't throw shit like that. Oh, people That's the official shit. Julian. No, man, don't Superflex make, Mega Contest 2024. I wonder how these babies are selling. You know what? These things are selling pretty good, I think, Bubs. Do you people guys. know that these are out? Look at that. Look at that. Ricky did a good job with those uh, the drawings, I, I gotta say. Ricky did all the artwork. I think it stops people in their tracks and they look at it, they're like, what the fuck is that thing? 
They're like, who, what child made what these kind potato of a chips? fucking stone child did that? <laughs> I can't They're pretty believe good, you got dude. your own potato chips. Yeah, but you know what? I think I fucked up the contract because they've been out for a while. I haven't heard from them. No money. There's no nothing, man. So we're selling all kinds we're of We're selling them. a lot. Maybe we can get some free ones if we go down to the Giant Tiger. We might get some free ones. I don't know. Maybe. I love that place. We should go to the we're Giant Tiger. I mean, that, that alone, we're on the back. There's a picture of us, right? Why don't we go to the Giant Tiger? They've got some We're going to go and do that. We're going to nice go pants. talk to them. They do. They've got some good pants for like 15 bucks. These yeah. things never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. Never going to give you I was testing you. I know, man. That's Ashley. You better get fucking excited. <laughs> what? Because do you know what came in this week? Nope. Julian Superflex contest submissions. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what? How fucked are they? They're fantastic. They're fantastic. Remember when I started the contest? I barely, yes. I didn't think it was going to happen. People actually made... People took that serious? It is serious. It's not fucking serious. It was a joke, I thought. No, it was Julian, and I just came up with it on the spot, and now it's a contest. Fuck. Superflex. Superflex. Bob, that's the stupidest fucking thing ever, man. Yep. Oh, you think so, do you? Uh, Here, tell me this is stupid. Watch this. She's loading up here. So these are real fucking... This is a... You know the song I played. Julian is ripping yeah, off his shirt with his muscles well. so he can do a super flex. Listen to this. Made it into a real song. Ready to get it. Oh my fuck, bubs. Look at the look at the video, man. Oh, Jesus Christ. Look at the abs on you there. You wish? You wish you had those? Yeah, did he Photoshop me into that? Yes. Let me see. Oh, it's just... Swayze. <laughs> it's the most fucked up thing I've ever seen in my life. You know what? And that's not... How can you call that a song, bud? Listen. Oh, ripping shit off. It's a remix. It's, it sounds like shit, man. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. That's you know how much work would have went into that? Well, it looks like a lot of work was put into it. It doesn't make it any better, man. Muscles. He sampled it. Muscles. <laughs> All right. So, how, how much drugs was that guy on? A lot. What That's kind a lot of, of drugs. Bath salts? Ricky's arm is destroyed. That's very fun. His shoulders <laughs> way the can fuck you show, up here. Can you open this, Ricky, so that well, the camera... This... Sit straight onto the camera so that people can see. This isn't... This is real. This is actually, like, bone. It's supposed to be down in... in the Just rest. sit with this arm down so they sit, can look see. At that. Look at you, the shoulder. You are fucked up, man. <laughs> it's not... That, and that's real. That's There's no padding <laughs> or anything in there. No, it's not great. Hopefully they can fix it. Well, you know what? You're a hero, man. Okay, like so just wait. Bubs. Yes, I understand. But so what you're claiming is you come out of the grocery store. Was it? Was, no. Yeah. Yeah. No, see? Now see, I'm Rick, trying to. the mall. Grocery store. Okay. So explain to me again the series of events. Just get going to my car and... Just putting in some some chips, and a roll of duct tape, and a bunch of markers. And I in the parking lot. Look over and it's fucking. Yeah, that's when I saw it out of the corner of my eye this bear. Is this the one? Yeah, I get to be happy. Go happy he is. Randy put his shitty fingers on Ricky's handle, and now Ricky is mad with shit finger. Hey, slick poo, get over here. Hi, Tracy and Martina. I get a tub every night, pour myself glass of strawberry kiwi wine, light my French vanilla toast candle, throw in my bed baths pumpkin cinnamon angel bath bomb for some relaxing mama time. Mm -hmm. I lock my four toddlers out with their stepfather, Darvon, Shea, Levi, and Chevron. Laugh my ass off. Fend for yourselves. 
<laughs> me and my pit bull Coda get in the tub for some relaxing mama time. I soak until the water's cold and my fingers are raisins. Coda basically falls asleep on top of me. But every single time when I get out of the bath, I'm head to toe red fucking blotches. Wondering if this is something that you've experienced before. Let me know. P.S. Loves the pod. I have. I love that you're taking the time. Is that Jess? Jess. I love that you're taking the time to put yourself first, hon. Mm -hmm. That's mama time. That's yep. me time. And that's very important. I'm always saying this. Really like dope and liquor dependent, though. Like if I don't get one of those two things, then I'm fucked. Then you're my, life, my life would be a living hell. Because if, if Ricky hates your guts, then that's going to be awful. Town's buzzing. Oh, I guess it is. Actually, I'm sorry. Actually, the, the whole fucking island is buzzing. So I don't know if you've heard, but the uh, win and lottery ticket was sold in New Otterford yet a fucking again. I don't know. Like, there's something going on. There's something on. with New Otterford because how many fucking times this have they like won the jackpot? This is like five or six. Oh, here we go, man. You don't got to touch me, man. <laughs> you didn't answer my message, Tracy. I was going to do a nice thing for you. I sent you the... I was busy looking after a baby. Oh, I guess so, I was yeah. The new there. novelty, I, I heard my phone going off. I said, nope, quality time with mama. If he's vouching for Connor as as this hockey guy, right, but he knows fuck all about hockey, who's bringing in a guy who knows fuck all about hockey, right. to well, that's me... that's why I'm asking you, because you're my hockey guy. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm a fucking... I'm a hard no, like... Fuck. She said it wasn't. She took him to the doctor. But I just posted it on Facebook because when you get a rash, you put it on Facebook and you and you just see what people are saying. How are you trying to chirp a goal that was scored? I'm not chirping it. I'm asking. I don't know how they let it. I'm, I'm just saying. I don't know how they let it be a goal. What was the penalty? Well, the penalty. Your foot was in the crease. You can't score with, a, with your foot in the crease. Wait. What do you mean bukaki? What is that? I don't know what Bukaki is. <laughs> Stop, you don't know what Bukaki is? No. Oh, good. Stop. Oh, school is in fashion. Seven guys, like circle jerking on onto, a, onto a lady. On, well, it doesn't have to be a lady. On anyone. On anyone, on whoever. Wow. <laughs> um, wait, what are you? I'm just trying to get power. <laughs> Oh, they're they're literally googling a video for me to watch so I understand what. I was saying, you don't know what hockey is. Like that's crazy. I mean, person. I've watched a bunch of guys circle jerk around a girl, but I've never I never knew it was called bukkake. <laughs> <laughs> she stands up on her hind legs to the mic. She does that in all your dreams. To the right? microphone. I don't know. She loves doing karaoke in my dreams. So anyway, and she's got this like, kind of like leather jacket type thing. Yeah. Right funky looking. And she shaved. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh my God, someone's listening to Pink. Yeah. Anyway, so no, I was joking. She goes up to the microphone and everyone starts listening and she goes, I, I, I. Like crazy train. Okay. And I'm like, what the fuck does this mean? But then she goes, oh. New Waterford whistle. The 830 whistle. And I knew that she was home. Would you rather uh, get really, really high with Ricky on his edibles? Like so high that you actually get institutionalized and like <laughs> you have PTSD and, and you're never the same. Like you, you're so fucked from that crazy time you had with Ricky. Um, or would you rather have bubbles have bubbles as eyesight for the rest of your life and not be able to see a thing oh wow that's <laughs> wow welcome to a place i'm pretty sure you haven't fucking heard of spring hill located in the sweatiest part of atlantic canada's gooch in its long dead glory days spring hill was known for coal mining disasters and someone called anne murray but today it's just famous for opiate abuse and an overwhelming sense of fucking despair. But despite all this, one man wants to fix things. Nobody knows why, but as is a free fucking country, we can't stop it. 
he's a walking jawbone and a pudding robot on rotor wheels. I can I can relate to that. Really? Does he, does well, he he's a pudding robot on rotor wheels. Does so. he hang out with Noel Fielding? That's <laughs> what I'd like to know. And is that what is that? It's a soiled bean. No, I think it bean, it's, it's a night dress. I think it's uh, shit. I think it was up his arse. No, but what is that? What is that a heart? What? Not, get that fucking thing away from me, man! Like seriously. <laughs> Just put it on your hat for no, one second. No, no, no. Here, let me see it for a second. Oh no, you're gonna examine it? <laughs> Jesus it Christ. It says it's soiled with beans. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, it still came out of his arse. Ah. Beans that came out of his arse. Spicy mayo's given with dips now. I like just the ketchup. How come McDonald's is giving me spicy habanero? You probably like that, because you like the spicy ketchup chips. I don't like Habanero, oh, it's every, too every much. Every drive-thru you go through now, it's like spicy habanero, spicy this and that, spicy ranch. It's a big kick right now, and I don't like it. Yeah, they're just trying to like come up with any. They're throwing everything at the wall, right? Yeah. Because it's like sriracha, creamy sriracha, ranchy ranch, ranch sriracha. Ranchy sriracha. <laughs> I don't fucking Holy know. Holy fuck. No. I, I had so ketchup and gravy. I'm a ketchup and gravy girl. Yep. I'm the same. That's the only shit that belongs on French fries. Oh, and ranch. I like vinegar sometimes too. Vinegar depends where the fries vinegar are from. The chips. I at least it's like real like hand cut. Um, the big chunky ones. The big chunky ones. You need a little bit of, yeah. Vinegar and salt. Oh, from the fry wagon. Oh. Yeah. Would you rather, every time you come, like orgasm, um, you shoot out El Dante spaghetti noodles, um, and what are they? What's an El Dante? Oh, El Dente. El Dente. El Dante. El Dente. El Dente. I, like you said it, like it was a hot sauce. Oh, sorry. No, El Dente. No. Okay, Canada, El Dente, Dente spaghetti noodles <laughs> out of my penis while I'm ejaculating. Or, That's right. Or would you rather slice off your nipples with like a normal sharp knife, okay? And uh -huh. um, you throw them in a frying pan <laughs> and, you, and you eat them. And also the, the noodles you have to Wait, eat. Wait, do it. Well. Oh, okay. Um, can I put the nipples on a pizza, on like a, on like a pizza, and like serve it at a little party? Another obviously glaring issue hits. Connor's estimate of 70 to 80 players is rounded down to less than fucking 20. Well, we'll get 70. We'll guarantee. So I when guarantee. I sh when we show up at the rink on day one, there's going to be 70 skaters. Right. So it seems like Connor is totally fucked. But let's give him the benefit of the doubt and assume that the ones that did show up are fucking all-stars. Yeah, we got a couple players that he said, oh, we, maybe we should get this guy out or maybe we should get this guy out. Okay, bring him out. Like, these guys can barely fucking skate if they play a contact game against these teams, right? They, were, they weren't even close. Like, these, these guys were terrible. So I'm like, like... If, if this is who you're fucking trying to bring in here, right? Like, is is fucking general manager? Is that the right position for you, right? Maybe you should go back to me and stick boy. I don't know. I wouldn't carry his sticks if he paid me. Certificate of uh, no. Yeah, man, that's the real deal. That's the real deal. It's Patrick Swayze and Jennifer Swayze Gray. Swayze and Jennifer signed dirty no. dancing. Fucking. Are you fucking kidding me? That's amazing. In a in a kick-ass old fucking Frame. weirdo frame. That is something else. Is it really a certificate yeah, of authenticity? Man. I'll start. I gotta look at it. It's like a fucking. That's a fucking Patrick Swayze signature, dude. That's, That's fucking amazing, man. I'm trying not to. Ah, oh, I want to own that. I know. I'm trying I'm not to look joked. as excited as I am because I get a lot of heat because of this fucking guy. You show us how excited you are, bud. Thanks, man. I'm Come gonna on. cry. I'm gonna fucking cry. I think. Would you rather your dick is a bop it toy? Do you remember those boppets? Oh yeah, I played with one recently. I mean the boppet, uh, not the, the bop it. penis. <laughs> not the penis. So yeah, great, great fun toy um, from the '90s. So your dick is a an actual boppet toy, um, and sometimes, unfortunately, it goes off in really um, inappropriate situations. Um, and the only way to turn it off is to pull down your pants and. Bop it. Play bop it with it okay. and bop it. Yeah. Bop yes. it, twist it, pull it, push it, whatever. Yes. Yeah. 
you know. Or um, would you rather um, your limbs, all of your limbs on your body mm -hmm. are made out of glow in the dark, silly putty. Um, mm -hmm. So you can like, yeah, you know, silly putty, you can stretch and do whatever, but you're never allowed to wash. So. Oh, so they stink. All three fucked in the head. Can't get on the same page. <sighs> Smith, wasted all the time. Rob, nope, nothing can't do. Fuck all. JP playing both sides. Really teeter daughter. I upload it, I'm fucked. I don't upload it, I'm fucked. I smoke, I can't smoke. Not a clue, to be totally honest, whether or not I'm allowed to be high right now. Ryan takes to the ice. Dave finally arrives from Vegas and the management team just can't get along. Connor Smith would be my absolute last pick. You said you don't know me. I don't fucking know you either. Would you rather get a very sexy invite from Pedro Pascal, but when you get to his house, um, he shows you his penis, and unfortunately, his penis is a Mr. Potato Head arm. Like the the white oh. slim little thing with a, okay. with a, like, a hand. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All um, right. Okay. You seem really into that. Uh, <laughs> or, <laughs> or would you rather get a sexy invite from uh, Pedro Pascal and you find out um, that he has this insanely crazy weird Al Yankovic fetish? Um, and his entire place is, is all Weird Al, and he's actually dressed as Weird Al, like head to toe. You can't even see that he is Pedro Pascal. Brian gets out of the car. Oh no. Jacked, like he looks good. Well, he's police officer, do you see? Mm -hmm. They have to see and in shape. he got his fucking uniform on. He said, put your hands on the hood of the car right now. No way. Put your this is all on the live this stream? Is, this is a cop. Put your hands on the hood of the car oh, right now. Oh, you're gonna send me this. No, you're gonna send me this. nothing. I never done nothing. She's trying to run away, but goes back to get her scooter. He fucking pummels her, puts her on the ground, grinds her face into the fucking dirt. He's got her arms twisted. She's screeching, you're fucking hurting me. You're fucking hurting me. And uh, he's like, fuck you. Get on the fucking ground. He's holding his gun. Oh my God, Tracy. Puts the cuffs on Cynthia. Yeah. But you know what? I was like, fucking right. Fucking right, you you just fucking poke the poke the wrong bear there. Do you know what though, Tracy? So that thing's in uh, getting arrested. Do you know what that's a good example of though? What's that? Do you know what Oprah says? Hmm. Hurt people, hurt people. I'm, I'm not gonna throw myself under the bus because he's got fucking some delusional thoughts about getting well, this is 70 your first yeah. fucking delusional. Well, no. this is our, he was a fucking scout. He knows everybody in the fucking area. Yeah, well, we no, can't I'm... do fucking math. If I walk in the rink and there's 80 guys there, I'll be like, sweet. If I walk in and there's less. Dude, when you walk into the rink on the first day of tryouts, you will find 80 fucking people. Okay. With your own fucking eyes. When you walk into the rink on tryout day and you, see, see? and you see 80 people, right? You're gonna wake up from your dream and say, <laughs> oh fuck. There will be 80 people. That's just, you know. Okay. We said we were gonna work together. We'll. Like, okay. We'll I'll do I'll it. Work. I'll we'll we'll, shit, we'll get as many as we can. We'll get as many as we can. I'm predicting on the high side, 35. Would you rather be a real life Kevin McAllister? Okay, from Home, home Alone 1 only, okay. okay, um, okay. But um, unfortunately, um, you get bit by Buzz's tarantula and somehow you slowly morph into a spider um, until you're 85 years old and die and here's the humdinger you shoot spider webs and only spider webs that's that's your that's your cum just uh <laughs> just a dusty old web all right um or would you rather you get plastic surgery the whole nine yards um to become a real life mrs doubtfire you <laughs> You want to see your kids, uh, you want to pose as a nanny, you know, like you you want it to actually happen just like it did in the movie. But unfortunately, your wife doesn't give a shit and um, she takes herself and the kids and they move to Australia. You're banned from Australia. You, you can't go there. So now 
you're 30 years old and you look um, like Mrs. Doubtfire forever, but you don't shoot cobwebs. You have normal cum. Are you a big Trailer Park Boy fan? Yes. Okay, great. So <clears throat> would you rather uh, share a jail cell with Ricky, but he fucking hates you, like hates your guts, cannot stand you, but you have to share a jail cell with him. Or would you rather share a jail cell with Julian, but you are his bitch? You gotta do anything that guy fucking tells you to do. And I mean, anything. That's rough. I'm probably gonna go with Ricky and only because I feel like I could probably win him over if I got some good hash or some like, <laughs> some liquor. Like, you know, he wouldn't be too hard to like get on his good side, I feel like after a while. Where if Julian, right. if you're his bitch, I just think that you're in the bitch zone forever. Who, who would you kill? Uh, oh, that's a tough one. I don't want to kill any of the boys. Oh, Julian, forgive me. It, it would be <laughs> Julian. Oh, I don't really want to, but. I know, I know. So are you saying that you would repopulate the world? <laughs> Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. Just say it. Okay. <laughs> With bubbles. <clears throat> Fuck you. I'm going to actually go out on my own and I'm just going to follow through with my idea. All right. Well, that's the best damn salary I ever did have. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get too fucked up, man. I'm going to take care of things, okay? After today. <laughs>